okay, that's not actually going to be my intro from now on. I'm just uh, experimenting a little bit. What you see here is the aftermath of the these videos. I uh, got a whole bunch of crap all over the place. And uh, I'm going to have to clean it up later. But until then, we're going to switch over to some of the footage I recorded for the games. Now, I did this video a little bit different than I thought I was going to do it. I actually didn't have all the games installed, and instead I decided to record while I was installing them and testing them out. And it made for some pretty good moments. So I'm going to switch over to that video footage right now. Sonic CD install weed. Okay. I can do that. Dumb game. And put a crappy ass color. <laughs> oh my god, it's in stereoscopic 3D. I'm I'm seeing this is not just the S video malfunctioning. This is this is on out of, out of DVI to Holy shit. Oh my god. Well, now it's not showing up on S video anymore, but it was showing the in Okay, now I think it's just totally fucked. Okay. Okay, let's not go full screen. Oh, but I want to smooth Sonic. Hell yeah! Just screw it. Let's just do it. Maybe if I get it close enough to the screen, it'll be 3D. Oh god, no it's not. Oh no it's not. Oh god, that is terrible. Um... So yeah, escape is your jump button. And there's no in-game sound effects for some retarded reason, but... Who cares about that, because we got CD audio, baby. Spencer Nelson in the house! Oh yeah, <laughs> I'm getting migraine. <laughs> it's my favorite Sonic game of all time! I tried to install this in a previous video, in the Ultimate DOS Machine Revisited, and it failed horribly because it couldn't read the disc. Things will be different this time because... the disc is not damaged. Are you serious? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 640 by 480. Man. Piece of shit. I will install your new Microsoft Kids program in the C drive of your computer. Change. Oh, I can't actually change the directory. That's great. Just like, fuck you. We're gonna put you in C. Alright. Oh, okay. I'm gonna take note of that product ID at the bottom there. Oh yeah, and I was right about the install being more fun than the actual... Oh god. Uh, I think this whole thing is cursed. I mean, it's really good. It's a really good game, but I mean, this is... This is... Oh god. What? Um... No? System speaker instead? I can't believe this supports PC speaker. I, I didn't know that at all. Answer no. Uh oh, not again. Not oh, it's duality vision. Uh. Groovy! Damn right. Best performance. You think I give a shit about performance? Earthworms, yeah. Difficulty. Easy, because I'm a bitch. You can actually die right there. Like, just in that little space. You can fall down there. I've, fall, I've, I've died there before. It's, can I do it again? Scratch my ass. If you have Steam, and you happen to have Earthworm Gym 1, this Windows 95 version, this is actually being played on Windows 98. is actually better than 
your DOS crap, your DOS box crap version. I know you jelly, because... <laughs> yeah! Ugh. Cyber Patrol. Internet Cyber Patrol. To surf and protect. That is the lamest thing I've ever seen. So let's enjoy the sunshine with this next game. Um, I, I didn't actually know what this was when I was a kid, but you definitely want this second one. Groovy. Now, the problem is here is that a lot of people don't like this game. Because apparently it's shit. Ready, set, go! Go! This is for like... Jesus, my ears. Why is that so loud? Okay, maybe I... It's gonna be a brighter day. I can't hear the music over. This is like professionally produced music. You can't hear any of it because it's. Maybe that's because I have to be Sonic. Didn't know what retire meant in accordance to this, but I was like, is that quit or do I actually like retire? Just be like my dad. Let's try it again. Wait, Resort Island and it's snowing? Are you kidding? Eh, whatever. Weather system is good. Okay, when I said, have the sound effects be turned down, I didn't mean turn them off. There's just CD music now. Okay, this game is conscious, and it is pissed. Okay, well, I didn't know the texture quality was that bad. It is a Sega Saturn port, so I guess I can't really be too pissed with it. Um, okay. Music volume on. Because that's how you do it. Oh, the best game in the world. Fun Pack 3D. I tried selling comic books at my school, and I got in trouble with the principal, but my software piracy didn't know. Let's take a look at the options menu. Faster or better? I guess people's computers actually lag trying to play this game, which I think is hilarious. What is going on on the bottom of the screen? So much for 640 by 480, it's crapping out, man. So yeah, I played this game to absolute death. And I got pretty far in it, and I don't know how many levels there are if we can actually beat it, but I think it just keeps going on and on. And just randomizes the levels, and then of course we have... Uh, I love how there's like no mouse acceleration in Windows 98. Just by default. Oh man, this game is awesome! I mean, it is just all, every single one of these games is just a 3D version of an Atari game. Whether it be Breakout, whether it be Asteroids, I'm just now realizing this. It's got Pac-Man, it's got Asteroids, it's got Breakout, and it's got uh, uh, Missile Kick. How did I not notice that? I grew up with this shit, and then I actually got an Atari 2600. And, uh, I didn't make this connection until literally just right now, or 15 seconds ago. Wow, I mean, you thought, you think it would be pretty obvious, I mean, look at this. I, oh no, it's got the flickers again. This happens sometimes. This is just a glitch with the, I'm, ugh, I'm gonna throw up. Oh god. Begin round. Also, the music in Brick Breaker was killer. I might record some of it and just use it in some of my videos. Because, oh my god. It is just like some club stuff. I don't even know what it is. It's really good, though. 
Like, what? It's it's grooving, man. Oh my god. Oh, I'm gonna throw up. Oh god. We're playing Command and Conquer now. So this is actually really cool, even to this day. It just looks awesome. It's like you've got some big guns, some big firepower. You make oranges in this orange slices in the sky and you destroy ICBMs. Although I didn't actually know what those were. I thought maybe they were comets. I didn't grow up during the Cold War, so I didn't really know about this sort of stuff. Slit? Slit. Don't fuck with Slit. Oh, it's Strunk Track Driver. Not S T Slit? Slit. Okay. Okay, seriously, what are these meters even for? I mean, I know what they're for. I mean, this shows how much disk space you have left. This is the current file. This is the time to completion. And this shows you if your disk space is running low. So you could be like, oh shit, it's running low. Let's cancel it. Ladies and gentlemen, I bring you Stunt Track Driver. But you've already seen it. <laughs> if you know what this is, you've already seen it. <laughs> so yeah, this is Snut Track Driver. And I already crashed. <laughs> I'm having such a difficult time choosing. I mean, I'm not going to play this game through right now. I'm just testing to see if it works. It appears to. So I'm not gonna poop myself over it. You will never crash into that train, ever. Ever. Shit. Alright, so we've hit nostalgia game number 47 so far. Okay, seriously, this is a hamster wheel. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's what that was, unless there's a specific Hot Wheels thing. I mean, I know this game is like one huge advertisement for Hot Wheels, and it worked. All I had to do was buy this one game, and it makes me want to buy all the tracks. Like, I didn't even want tracks until this game came along. Oh, I got a car. Spiffy. It was actually the car that just passed me. That's the one I just unlocked. What are the chances? That one. Right there. One that almost kicked my ass. Okay, well, I clearly hit the side there, but... Uh, Pre-rendered FMVs are forever. HOLY SHIT! My ears just died. Okay, what are the stats? They're, they're exactly the same as this. Well, let's use it anyway. Because it goes faster, but it has less. I forgot. Oh my god, its stunt is terrible. It was stunt. I thought it was something else. Oh god, this is not going to go very well. Uh. Damn it, Julie! Fuck! Crap. That's ridiculous. Oh, now my stun's better. You know, that, that's one of those badass 90s things. The electricity, that was, that was like, whoa, that's so cool. That hurts to quit it so soon, but I gotta keep going.
Oh, I forgot to play this one. Forgot the CD drive though. Let's check out the display options. Uh, maybe I do want the anti-aliasing. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, say well, that sounds pretty good. All right. Now this is probably the best test of Go oh God. It's lagging. Low FPS ahead. I may actually have to turn the graphics down for this game because we're looking at dynamic shadows, guys. Oh my lord, look at this. And I mean, my recording computer is a separate computer, so the FPS you're seeing is what I'm seeing, so... I'll tweak it. Fixed. <laughs> Alright, a little bit better. Graphics are all the way down now. I can't see anything. It's quite a foggy day out today. Oh my god, those barrels. I just had a flashback. Oh god, the barrels. Really. No, the sound asset. Oh my god. The sound assets for this game really don't sound that great. Holy shit. Jesus. Whoa. Okay, this game's still cool today. I'm not gonna edit any one real maps in, on Windows 98. And even if I did, I mean, who the hell is gonna play this game anymore? If they're gonna play, they're gonna play Unreal Tournament, not Gold. Now, I guess there's probably like two people on Steam who have Unreal Gold, but. Ugh. Extreme Lab! Extreme. Go ahead, you can do it. Come on, let's see those sexy graphics. Oh, mm, 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 the reflection! Oh, you can't even see it. It's so dark. Death wish. And this is the part of the game that made me shit my pants when I was a kid. Like it's already freaking me out. Like today, I think it still gives me the willies. Like the funny thing about this is that I thought it was gonna be this dark horror hallway corridor linear shooter with nothing but gore everywhere and the majority of the game is you're in the jungle like right after this level you're in the jungle and uh you're in temples and it's like tomb raider more it's more tomb raider than it is you know space marine whatever the fuck so anyway let's get Prisoners through this eight, four, nine, level. eight four nine okay Well, that was quick. Wow, that's never ever happened to me before. And that's it, game over. Can't do anything. Okay, this is the worst thing I've ever seen in my life, right here. Are you guys sure you're ready for it? I don't know. This gore right here freaked me out so much. I don't know if you guys are ready for this. You see her, like her arteries are coming out her leg. Wow, it has no effect on me now. That means I've become desensitized to gore. No thanks to this game, of course. And this guy was clearly impaled, or he's just clipping through this. Either way, we can use our imagination to see how horrible the deaths of the prisoners aboard the Vortex Rikers ship. The fuck? Did you hear that? Something growled. Okay, this is like the coolest experience I've ever had playing this level. What is happening here? This is not... This is weird. I'm a little scared. The translator won't shut up, by the way. The whole game, the translator won't shut up. It's... You know, I have another video uploaded on my channel called Unreal Promo Vid. 
And the quality of this video sort of matches that one. It looks like an analog VCR recording. It looks about the same. I can't get the colors to look very good. I do apologize for that, but jeez. So the horrible screens, I mean, it's very atmospheric. This kicks the shit. Out of, uh, Quake 2. And that made me poop my pants when I was a kid. Uh, come in here. You look down and realize that you're some sort of hot chick. And, uh... I think you see the Scar Warrior in here or something. It's like, oh, I like the Kevlar suit. Do you know what I'm, I'm gonna get in some trouble now. Oh yeah, there's the liquid effects, which is well, that's kind of cheap looking. I mean, it I mean, it looks like we're looking through like the haze of the '90s right now. It it looks like a VCR recording right now of somebody recording <laughs> their Windows 98 rig, and that is almost exactly what I'm doing, except it's 2014, and this is yeah. You have entered a restricted area. Oh really? I don't know why I always walk this way around the edge. I guess because I'm following the rules or something, and to get the health packs, because I could just you know walk around here. And the most terrifying part of the entire game. And his organs spray under the door. Everywhere. You know, I knew this guy who said when he played Unreal Engine 1, like basically Unreal 1, he's playing Unreal Tournament, not Unreal 1, but he's like, he could do little biology lessons with the gore. He, he, he talked about that or something. It's kind of creepy. In first aid station, break glass. Okay, let's look at this. Look how fucking fancy this first aid room. This is a prison ship, okay? Like, how, how, is this like your only health kit in the entire, it's like, it's all lit, it's on a mirror surface, it's got a dedicated huge sign, what? I think the mappers were just trying to, like, make it look fancy, I, I just think it's hilarious. <laughs> Getting actually some FPS drops, believe it or not. But I can't really, it's 98. Right, glass again, and let's read the, the log there. Shit! Okay, so let me just you play through this whole part of the game right here just to get to this one singular moment here. You get freaked out and you walk out to a world that is unreal. Then you make a volcano with your gore. Atari Insider. Ooh. Uh, internet. I could connect myself to the internet, but I really don't want to right now. Afra. Please wait while your web browser launches the Hasbro Interactive Registration webpage. If you experience problems with registering, web registration successful. 
You can fucking lie and say you registered when you really didn't. Wow, I've never done that before. Apparently you can't choose hardware rendering because this thing is a... Oh, there we go. Never mind. Uh... Oh, great. My monitor doesn't like whatever this is throwing up on me. <laughs> it's broken. I... I have to restart my computer. Oh, thanks for the heads up. It looks like malware. I don't think I actually played this on Windows 98, so... Let's see if we can get lucky here. Gabon- Gaben! I'm- I'm from the country Gaben! That's not valid. You pick, really? Oh, that's not email address. Where's the Oops. Really? You don't believe me? You wanna bet? Anti aliasing? Are you pooping? Let's do it. Hey, it's smooth as butter. And how do I jump? Is it control all Oh, it's right control, alright. Okay, but of course, who plays a 3D Pac-Man game and doesn't use this view? You don't know what's going on, but you do it anyway, because it's like, oh, I paid this much money for a new 3D game, bought a 3D card for my Windows 98 machine, so I'm going to go ahead and do it. It's like, what's going on on the other side of the map? Who cares? Can't see it? Not of my problem, man. Here's an example of the third dimension that is used. Yes, let's actually do that. Printer? Yes. Modem? No. Continue. Smoke weed every day if you want. Apparently that's valid. And continue. Uh, through a long evolved process of computer algorithms and brilliant deductions, we figured out that you have a printer? Well, okay, we looked at the box you checked, but that doesn't sound very impressive. Make sure your printer is turned on and properly hooked up to your computer. Oh, shit. Reticulating spline. Yeah, baby. Nothing's happening. What is blowing up? I don't even have anything over there. Don't you understand? It's blowing up nothing! Nobody even lives in my town yet. Sold out software. Sold out your ass. That's really not a good name for your... company. My children, Hydro Thunder, please. Hydro Thunder! Choose your track! Why does this look like 20 times better than the Dreamcast version? Oh, wait, because PC Master Race. Misbehave! Misbehave! Go, go. This game looks beautiful. Hey, yes. Secrets always in the waterfall at the end of a rainbow. Oh, man, this is beauty.
Exacto. Ok. I went through the lava. No wonder this game's so badass. I could have placed first. Advantages of having a three letter name. This is dramatic music right here. It's just like, game over, man. Sold out software. Yeah, I wonder what happened to them now. Alright everyone, that's it for the games, but we've got some incredible videos coming up in the near future, including, but not limited to, fun with Mac OS 9, more old Macintosh hardware overviews, old school Mandrake Linux, a Windows 98 LAN party, and much, much more. So stay tuned. Also, be sure to check out some of my other videos here.